Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to solve the integration problem by partial fraction method. So here in the denominator, we notice x power 4 and x square. So we can give substitution. Let t equal to x square and dt will be 2x dx and from this I can write dt by 2 as x dx. So in the numerator x cube should be written as x square into x then we have dx whole divided by rest of the terms as it is x power 4 plus 3x square plus 2. Now the entire numerator can be replaced as that is x square into x dx is replaced as t into dt by 2. So we can replace this as integral t then dt by 2 whole divided by this is t square plus 3t plus 2. Now from the numerator we can take 1 by 2 outside the integration then the remaining is t dt and this term we can factorize as t plus 1 into t plus 2. Now we have to apply the partial fraction rule. So let's take the expression alone that is t by t plus 1 into t plus 2 equal to both are different factors. So the rule is a by first factor plus b by second factor t plus 2. We are going to take LCM. So the LCM is t plus 1 into t plus 2. So a into t plus 2 plus b into t plus 1. Since both the denominators are same, we are going to equate the numerators on both the sides. So here the numerator is t and here a into t plus 2 plus b into t plus 1. Let's take some values for t. First let's take t as minus 2. So minus 2 equal to when I put t value here, this will become minus 2. The first term is 0 and I put minus 2 here. Then this will become b into minus 2 plus 1 is minus 1. After cancelling this, we come to know the value of b is 2. Similarly, when we take t as minus 1, so minus 1 equal to a into minus 1 plus 2 is 1 and the another term is 0. So from this, the value of a is minus 1. Now we are going to replace the value of a and b in the term where we apply the passive fraction and there is a half common for both. So we have to write half integral a value by which is t plus 1 and we have dt that is with respect to t then b by t plus 2 again plus half integral 2 by t plus 2 dt so now this is minus 1 by 2 log mod t plus 1 plus half anyway we can cancel these two so this will become just log of t plus 2 within mod plus constant and the value of t which we have taken in the initial step is x square we are going to replace it so minus 1 by 2 log mod x square plus 1 plus log mod x square plus 2 plus c. 